but he couldn't stop himself and slithered into a ditch. Oh. To wash Duck's fate. It curled round his boiler, crept under his loose dome, and lifted it off and away into the valley below. He banged the cars hard into the buffers, but the buffers weren't secure. Hide the brakes. The rails were now... from the hills. <laughs> Cried the elephant. Water went all over Henry. The ground, straight into the sheds. Stupid Lori was reversing and fell straight into the sea, said the... And it did. She was taking a bath, and the water was slopping all over the place. Oh! Help! Called Toby. We're going. <laughs> Engine lost control and plunged. Next, his driver seek. That's what I saw in my dream. It's coming true. My universe is starting to crumble. Some trucks were delighted. Wait. The statue flew through the air and landed in the lake. The old wooden bridge was, but the cracks in the supports were getting larger. A beam snapped. Timber pieces splashed into the water below. Oh, shouted Duncan. It's dangerous. And they splash into the duck pond. The flatbed crash into the buffers and then splash into the canal. It's too late. Max broke the water supply pipe. Water gushed everywhere. Suddenly, Alfie was sinking into a muddy hole. Flatbed so hard. They burst through the buffers, smashed through oil drums stacked on the wharf, and splashed into the canal. Too late. Toby splashed through the puddle. Henry as Thomas crashed straight through the block tunnel. With a mighty splash, Thomas landed in a pool of water. The bushes. He flew across a ravine and hit the ground with a bump. He hit the buffers 
and the billboard flew in straight into a big puddle of track started to sink. Emily was stuck. With a clang and a crash, Thomas clanked off the rails. His flatbed bashed his buffers with a bump. The last of the special blocks fell from his flatbed into the water. The buffers. With a splash, a sploosh and a splosh, Scarlowy plunged into Percival. As a streak of silver cracked, the track snapped wow. beneath him. The mighty... The car skidded and skated right into a muddy ditch. Sir Topham Hatt's car skidded and skated right into a haystack. Sir Topham Hatt's car skidded and skated right into a pond. <laughs> and Thomas steamed the <laughs> Then there was trouble. Muddy water flew high into the air and splooshed down all over Alicia Botti and Sir Topham Hat. Heavy flatbeds were pulling him. Crash! One flatbed cracked its cup. The Joby would tump. The next flatbed of Joby logs crashed and smashed into the water. One flatbed away from the edge of the cliff. And then, the last coupling snapped. The last flatbed of... And a crack. And a splash. Pop. And threw Thomas's flatbed into the logging pond. Creak and crumble. Then it cracked. Hit Gordon's buffer with a biff and a bash and a terrible smash. With a crack and a splash and a sploosh and a whoosh down the muddy wet track. Soon needs to stop me. Splash! Don't worry, boss! I've got it! But he missed the red signal. Hit the points, save the rails. into the sea, were you? I'm sailing, John. No place to mess around. Watch out! <gasps>
Oh! <laughs>